Hey guys, quick video today, but you guys remember that video I made about Paige Hathaway's client that won her transformation competition. All I said was that it was giving people unrealistic body expectations and the two pictures were very deceiving and can be easily faked because of the way that he was standing. And because I made that video, she blocked me. That right there makes me feel like Paige Hathaway might be a little fishy. And I also don't know why they block people because you guys already send me a lot of her things. I never looked up that picture. You guys sent it to me. So her blocking me does nothing. And you guys sent me another picture, so here we are making another video. But this time instead of weight loss, she has helped someone put on a lot of muscle in a short amount of time and it's a woman. And the time frame is five weeks and the amount of muscle that this woman put on is eight pounds. So let's check that out. Meet Shadel Mulier. I know everyone knows, we all know. I butcher everybody's name. The past client of Fit and Five Challenge and she put on eight pounds using my platform her starting weight, 133 pounds, and ending weight, 141. She says this challenge came at exactly the right time. It was going to be my key to try to unlock the body of my dreams. I'm just super proud to have successfully completed the challenge. I've gained confidence, trust in myself that I can do anything I put my mind to, and insight on the new lifestyle I've decided to continue to commit to. The results are a healthier body and mind on all levels, a better sleep, better skin, and uplifted spirit. I'm grateful for this program and how it helped me stay on track with reaching my personal health and fitness goals with continuous guidance and support. So once again, this is also misleading to people who are not educated when it comes to building muscle and how long it actually takes a long time. And I feel like this time I might just be a little bit uh, biased because she decided to block me for some reason, but I feel like she is straight up lying at this point. Just look at the video that Paige Hathaway posted about her putting on eight pounds of muscle in five weeks. So like I said in my first video, she's looking dowdy, depressed, the lighting is making her look pretty, you know, like washed out, shoulders kind of slumped over, moving at an awkward pace. She just looks done with life. The after, she's flexing. She's got a nice glow to her skin. She even has makeup on. She looks confident. She's flexing once again. She's flexing. She's flexing. She's flexing. I went to the original poster's Instagram page and look at her before pictures. She's standing different. Feet are close together. Feet are apart. The camera angle is slightly different as well. I think the before is a little higher and the after is a little lower. And I can tell that by the chin. Her underwear is pretty low on the first picture. Her underwear is now hiked up into the crevices of her vagina in the after. And it just gives her a better shape. And lastly, she's flexing her abs. If this chick put on eight pounds of muscle, eight pounds of solid, muscle, it would be showing in her legs, which might I add, they look exactly the same as the other picture. Her shoulders would have a little bit more size, but once again, they look exactly the same as the other picture. It just looks like she was holding in a good old poop in the first picture, and the second picture, she released the poop. And in the picture that I'm looking at right now, she's saying that this was an 18-day transformation. What type of transformation can anyone have in 18 days? Minus being majority water weight. I hope everybody understands that it takes a very long time to put on muscle. A lot of these really big social media influencers, the fit ones, like to tell you that it, it doesn't take that long. It takes like a month to put on eight pounds of muscle. Easy. If that was true, there wouldn't be so many girls struggling to get a bigger butt. Come on, this is like slap in the face. Paige Hathaway thinks that we are all just dumb. Let's just see what Google says. Not even like a, a full on, you know, muscle type website, but let's just see what Google said. Based on all of this, here's how fast you can expect to build muscle on average. Average natural man between 0.25 and 0.5 pounds of muscles per week, or about one to two pounds of muscle gain per month. Average natural woman between 0.12 and 0.25 pounds of muscle per week, or about 0.5 to one pound of muscle gained per month. And this chick put on eight, so you're going to sit here and tell me, Paige Hathaway, that your plan is so good that she put on eight pounds of muscle because your plan is so good. That's not how it works and I might be sounding a little harsh in this video, but it really sucks to see people full on just lying about their programs. There is no, you know, just amazing program that's going to give you eight pounds of muscle in a week unless there's some kind of surgery going on. And she must feel some type of way or that she knows that she's doing something wrong because she turned off comments. Because people were calling her out and that just shows how much she cares about other people or have some type of remorse because she left the post up so that people that are not educated in fitness will see this and think, wow, I can put on eight pounds of muscle but then they can't go to the comments and read actual trainers' comments that say 
No, you can't. This is a scam. That just proves that she only cares about money and making sure that people purchase her five days till fit or whatever it's called plan. And that kind of makes me a little triggered. I don't care if people block me, that's fine. I will never stop talking about someone who is scamming people and taking advantage of people's lack of education in a certain subject. So I hope people see this video. I hope people share this. I hope people call her out because that's what people should do. That's rude. That is a slap in the face. That is her saying that, ha, you're stupid. You can't spot where I'm lying. It's just sad. She has so many followers. She doesn't need to do that. She makes good enough money, but this is what I'm talking about. People only care about money. It sucks. Yuck. Ew. That's why I only watch cartoons because I can't take real life people. It's like, why? Why do this? I can only think of they only care about money and that's it. So I will see you guys next time. If you have a topic that you want me to talk about or a page that you want me to review, make sure to leave it in the comment section. What do you think about this? How do you feel with Paige Hathaway basically saying, ha, huh, you're too stupid to spot this. I'll see all of you guys next time. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to thumbs it up. If you are not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. By the way, thank you for all the new subscribers. I greatly appreciate it. You guys are amazing. Yoshi says thank you too. And I will see you guys next time.